What is cracking yo guys? Crash Yo here and I'm here to bring you guys a video. Uh, it's kind of a different type of video. Somebody asked me, hey, um, my kids are on the spectrum and I needed some place to go as like kind of a safe space. Does Disney have space spaces where I can take my kid when they get out of control or the noises are too much for them? Yes, there are some safe spaces that I've seen. Um, I actually did research. There's actually um, a company that specializes in that, which I'll leave the link down below and you guys can go check it out yourself as well. But I did see another YouTuber do it, but he has different safe spaces than I do. And I have some safe spaces that I enjoy going to that work for me. And because you guys know I have two boys on the spectrum. Um, so it works for them when they get too like, when I notice the noise and everything else is going too crazy for them, we'll go to a little spot and uh, we'll check it out and it works. So I'm gonna show you guys in this video and you guys let me know down below in the comments if you guys know any other safe spaces that work for you and uh, go from there. But thank you guys very much. Hope you guys enjoy this video. I am Crash Jero, guys. I'm a vlogger here on YouTuber and a streamer on Twitch. So you guys want to come join and play games with me, you guys are more than, than welcome to. And hope you guys We're enjoy. over here by Harbor Gallery. You know the little chairs and tables are here? This is what you want to bypass. What you're going to do, I want to take you guys step by step. We're going to walk all the way inside. Now, I don't have my steady cam with me, so I'm holding it with my hand. So. I apologize for any shakiness, but there's a spot over here. It's kind of a quiet spot. People always, like, I didn't know about the spot until, like, someone told me about it. I was like, really? But sure enough, there is. And you come right here, and right here is a perfect spot where you get away from everybody, no one bothering you. It's kind of quiet. Yeah, like, little staircase. People come here for the photo ops. You have a cool view of, like, the river. And look at this, like, like I said, like right here, it isn't so bad at all. And this is what I'm saying, this is like one of like the hideaways that I know that. Like I said, I'm gonna do a video of stuff that I know of, not of, uh, there's other people out there who have their own perspective of spots. But what's cool is you can see like Splash Mountain right here, the bottom section. And then of course you have like Tom Sawyer's Island right over there, which is kind of cool. And it's like a little walkway, like I've never really been through all of it, I've only seen some of it, but it just goes out. It leads out all the way to the restaurant. The restaurant's right there. So it's like this little walkway right here. I'm not taking here, but it's like a hideaway spot. If you need that quiet time, or if you're your kids or yourself, you need to get away from the noise. There's a perfect hideaway spot where a lot of people don't know about. Some do, some don't. I'm gonna watch my steps kind of slippery, but. Perfect hideaway spot that a lot of people don't know about. It's crazy. I love this view. Look at that. All right, so over by the Matterhorn right here, you're gonna see a of course, little booth here. We have like food, but there's a section over here that's also a good hideaway spot. That um, if you need quiet time, like this up here is actually a pretty good quiet spot too. But that gets kind of crowded. I like a lot of characters up there do photo shoots. But right over here. In this section, you guys, this is like the perfect spot, like literally. It's just a, of course, no smoking spot in the parks. But this whole spot is like, it's usually empty, it's quiet, uh, it's not as crowded. Like I said, the ones up there get really crowded because you have like the character doing like the pictures up here. But back over here, it's pretty quiet. It's like a very really secluded area. It's not bad. It's like really perfect spot. Like if you want to like get quiet, get away from people, um, other than of course kids. But, it's quiet. And I think that before, back in the day, this used to be a ride. This was a, a boat ride. I don't remember if I rode it when I was a kid. I don't remember, but this used to be like a boat ride before they extended the whole car ride and everything else. But it's, now they just have it here as a leftover spot for uh, tables and chairs. But yeah, this little spot right here. Perfect spot, stop, take some peace of mind. <clears throat> Perfect little spot to, to take the little five ten minute rest you need cool down the sounds out of your head take some aspirin whatever it is just chill it's shaded you don't worry about the sun being here it's not so hot like i said there's like spots where people don't really sit at that i've seen once again but uh, it's not bad it's like a, it's a nice quiet spot just to sit and chill and relax and reflect on your day here at disney i like to come to a lot when i come to hungry bear restaurant is this section here of the patio this patio doesn't get filled up. You guys know that section over there gets filled up. And then even down below, that gets filled up really quick. 
Well, this one here doesn't get filled up, but of course it does have shade. And you do see the occasional train come by. You guys so I've probably seen a lot of my videos, I always sit up here, and because it's like the place I go to where it's like, it's not crazy, it's not loud, it's not too, too much. But you said it's a hungry bear restaurant. If you want to come chill and hang out, this side here never gets filled up fast. Uh, maybe later on in the day it might, but if it doesn't, a lot of times it doesn't. It's always those areas first before people hit this area. So you, there you guys go. There's my three spots right there that I know of, that I enjoy coming to, or that if I need to, because I do have two boys who have autism. So if I need to like calm them down, if I see them getting too like crazy with the crowds, this is where all the spots that I take them. So these spots work for me. Hopefully they work for you guys. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, make sure you guys do give this video a like if you appreciate it. And not only is this also a cool spot, but you see a cool view. You have the Tom Sawyer, or you have the, the boat, I mean the boat, the boat passing by. It's kind of cool, so I apologize. You got the train passing by every now and then. So like I said, these are really cool spots that if you ever need to get away, quiet time, or just come chill and just kind of take some time, reflect. These are the spots that I recommend you guys should go to because these are spots that work for me. So. That is where I hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time.